Hi everybody, I am Yair Prasad. Now I am going to explain you about see the cursor booth multiplication algorithm. In my previous video I explained just multiplication algorithm. Now we are going to discuss booth multiplication algorithm. The question was asked in October 2020 question paper with an example explain booth multiplication algorithm. This is the topic from computer arithmetics. See the cursor here. I will change the color. Booth multiplication algorithm. That is the topic from computer arithmetics. Already told you. Arithmetic means mathematical calculation. Right? Addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. That will be done outside the computer. We know very well on pen and paper from our elementary school. We did those things. But inside computer motherboard how it will be performed. Now we are going to see with the binary values. Right? So that is the topic from third unit. See the cursor here. Third unit from computer organization and architecture. So always I am telling this because you should know from which unit which question is coming so you can attempt easily without confusion. Right. The main difference between both multiplication algorithm and general multiplication algorithm is multiplication algorithm is done on unsigned values means positive numbers this will be done on signed signed values see here with theoretical explanation i will show you see here i will change the color booth algorithm gives a procedure for multiplying binary integers in signed signed two's complement representation signed it may be plus into minus or minus into minus value some x value y value x value y value and minus x value into plus y value right these are signed values x y plus minus 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 plus so sign value that will be changed into two's complement this is the key point here so the it will be done with arithmetic shift right one more key point and adder procedure so these three things we need to remember arithmetic shift right adder and the key difference between the two is the multiplication algorithm and both multiplication algorithm is two's complement signed values with signed values right okay so this was invented by andrew see the cursor here i'll put the marker also i'll change the color because it's in red color andrew Donald Booth that's why the name kept as Booth multiplication algorithm so I have taken example same example in the last video 23 19 minus minus have taken negative numbers so here we need to change it into binary representation not, nothing but signed magnitude right and we need to change it into one's complement and we need to change it into two's complement that's what here given right see the cursor two's complement then we need to do multiplication operation multiplication operation right so here 23 i already told you in my previous video if you are watching this first time i will tell you again 23 binary value that will be nothing but base 10 base 10 means radix 10 so decimal number that will be changed into binary by dividing with 2 to 11 22 remainder 1 2 5 are 10 remainder 1 2 2 are 4 remainder 1 2 1 are 2 remainder 0 we need to take bottom to top remember this is a node point and key point bottom to top kindanichi pike this quality right in our mother tongue i am telling 1 0 1 1 1 base 2 then this need to change it into one's complement one's complement means very simple one instead of one we need to keep zero and instead of zero we need to keep one see here zero one zero 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 right so that's the different and we need to add one to it then we will get the two's complement one zero zero one zero see here 0 1 0 0 1 
here because it's a minus negative number we will keep one here so that's two's complement of minus 23 same likewise minus 19 also i will remove all my markers so we need to change minus 23's two's complement how we will get 23's binary number by dividing two we will get uh, binary signed magnitude then we need to change it into ones complement by changing ones into zeros zeros into ones we will get ones complement watch my previous videos i will put in my description box the video playlist and watch till the end i will put the end of my uh, this video also and uh, video list i will put uh, multiplication algorithm both multiplication algorithm and playlist also i will keep so you will watch till the end you can understand it very clearly and simply right Minus 19 also we need to change like that only binary number first and uh, one's complement and two's complement then we'll get this number then we need to multiply this two so that we know from the elementary school uh, likewise in the previous video we will do this one into this and uh, we will shift uh, right and same wise this and then we will add that's what here we will do arithmetic shift right and add and two's complement we did two's complement also this two's complement we done right that's what the key point if you know this basic thing this basic thing the flow chart and this hardware diagram will be very easy this is a very very important smr question very simple i will explain you very simply now see here hardware implementation of the booth algorithm this is the title of the diagram hardware for booth algorithm you need to draw this border line which i have drawn with the green pen you need to draw with pencil and use black pen and blue pen black pen for side editing and blue black mixing you use this one don't use red pen and green pen red pencil for border mark use border marks two border marks use so that you will get good marks writing tips so you will get full marks right very simple uh, see here we will take br register this is one register and uh, the values we will take here is i will explain here the first value here in the in the scenario in the example we have taken 23 he told with example 23 that is called multiplicand first one is multiplicand br register that will be in one register br register and multiplier that is in qr register and the final result that will be in AC accumulator accumulator register AC is equal to BR into QR in BR we have 23 minus 23 into in QR we have minus 19 right AC result will be getting right that's what we will explaining with the hardware implementation of the diagram now see here BR register we are having the value that is nothing but br register we are having multiplicand multiplicand see here also if you ask only explain about hardware implementation of the diagram and he will give for five marks only draw this small diagram that will be big in your in your answer sheet right i put at one one slide so that you can understand it easily you draw this very big if you ask only for five marks only asked about hardware implementation of the booth multiplication algorithm you draw this one only right the draw this part only with big right very simple br register i will put a red mark br register holds multiplier multiplier and a complement next it will be changed into complement and a parallel adder parallel adder parallel it will be added and that will be changed into AC register accumulator AC means accumulator this is one type of register this will accumulate this is temporary register holds the uh, product value then that will be changed into QR QR register QR is uh, having multiplier these two will be multiplied and result will be given sequence counter initially it will be taken and it will be reduced one one after other and it when it reached to zero the process will stop right ac is a temporary or partial product uh, register that will store here one more box is taken that is extra flip-flop that is qn plus one this will be explained 
in this flow chart if you see this flow chart also you can understand that very simple this qn this qn is right i will show you here this value multiplicand this value right multiplicand least significant bit the starting bit least significant one by one we will take and here qn plus one initially be zero that's what here here in the flow chart he has given see here qn plus one qn plus one is extra flip flop right see here i have shown extra flip flop this small cell either it will store zero or one this is extra flip flop this qn is nothing but that multiply multiplicand this value multiplicand least significant first we will take this then we will do this then we will do this then we will do this 1 2 3 4 5 6 7. so sequence counter is 6 6 times it will be done after that it will be closed and final product will be got here in the accumulator register accumulator will collect the temporary and uh, partial product it will be having at the end it will be having final product that will be repeated right with with explaining this flow chart you will understand very clearly so see here for hardware implementation we require br register ac accumulator register and a qr register qr contains a multiplicand this will contains multiplier and we will do complementer and parallel adder right two's complement and parallel adder and that will be done repeatedly until the product will get outside and sequence counter is reduced one by one even it reaches to zero this loop will terminate and final product will be in the accumulator that's what here i have shown with a box right very simple i will explain you very simply this is hardware implementation or hardware for booth algorithm now i will show you the booth algorithm for multiplication of signed two's complement booth flow chart this is booth flow chart if you ask only booth flow chart and five marks don't draw this one draw this one only right if you given 10 marks full sms question draw both and explain which i am explaining now write those point bullet points right important points right see the title of the diagram booth algorithm for multiplication of signed two's complement signed two's complement this is a key point from multiplication and booth multiplication algorithm two's complement right signed values will be taken here right very simple now see here multiply first we need to multiply that value is i already told you multiplicand in br register and multiplier in qr register very simple so ac is equal to br into qr br having 23 minus 23 into minus 19 you can take any example i have taken this because in my previous video also i have taken this in the test book also given this only in maths mano right so very simple then in the next flow chart see this is a start multiplicand and multiplier here in the rectangle box ac ac is accumulator initially it will be clear to zero because accumulator will holds partial or temporary product values initially it should be zero it should be zero means it will it should clear to zero ac register clear to zero nothing should be there in that again next to product value will be there partial at the end after c uh, sc becomes zero the final product will be in the accumulator register very simple i will explain you very clearly if you don't understand revert uh, re this video forward it rewind it you can understand very clearly right pause the video and note the points very simple first accumulator is clear to zero then uh, qn plus 1 extra flip flop is also kept as zero right then sequence counter is n sequence counter that sequence counter is nothing but i will show you 
द नंबर ऑफ बिट्स विथ ए पेंसिल आई रोड द एक्सप्लेनेशन नंबर ऑफ बिट्स इन क्यू आर रजिस्टर मल्टीप्लायर राइट मल्टीप्लायर दैट इज नथिंग बट दिस वन सी हेयर दिस सेकंड वैल्यू हाउ मेनी वैल्यूज इट हैज ऑलरेडी टोल यू वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सो सीक्वेंस काउंटर एन इक्वल टू सिक्स राइट वेरी सिंपल सो सीक्वेंस काउंटर here in this scenario in this paradigm in this example we are having n as 6 n as 6 6 value 6 bits right then that will be reduced one by one next we are having a decision diamond shape in the flow chart diamond shape this is nothing but decision condition that condition is qn and qn plus 1 qn is least significant bit in the multiplier right least significant bit see here i am explaining very clearly and i will show you that's why i wrote in one slide right very simple i'll show you this one with the cursor if you don't understand with the cursor i will put the marker this one that is nothing but multiplier qr this is having 6 bit right least significant bit means this one then then next we become this then qn plus 1 become this one very simple so here first qn is 1 then qn plus 1 initially be 0 1 0 when it is 1 0 then next it will take qn as second bit and this bit will be shifted to qn plus 1 the second bit and similarly all then we will do here then this line accumulator will be here i will show you i will zoom it and i will show you very simple here we will get 1 into 1 1 1 into 0 all we will get this we know from our elementary school 0 into something all zeros then here we will add we will add it we will get in we will store in the accumulator partial value that is nothing but adder then we will shift it right we will shift a little bit then second this one one into this all we will get here from our element school we are doing childhood that will be added again and this will be stored in the partially or temporary accumulator again we will add we will shift it we will shift i with i wrote with the red mark plus shift and plus adder see those two two things i told you here very simple arithmetic shift right shift right and add with doing this two things in in the previous uh, multiplication algorithm also i told same thing only shift right and add but here the key point is two's complement two's complement because it's a signed values there it will be unsigned values both are positive numbers both positive 23 is positive 19 is positive no complement will be there here we need to take complement value because it's a signed values right that's a key difference then very simple so here when uh, this is a decision right this is a diamond flow chart see here diamond flow chart when this is having 1 0 this qn value 1 and qn plus value is 0 then it will change it to this side either it will go to this side either it will go to this very simple see here here it will be done ac accumulator accumulator plus br bar br dash br invert converter means it will be complement it will be changed it into ones complement plus 1 right very simple ones complement plus 1 means we will get twos complement of the value then it will be added to ac accumulator then it will change it to this here a a s h r means a means arithmetic arithmetic s h means shift r means right right arithmetic shift right so that will be accumulator and q r then sequence counter s c means sequence counter that that is the one type of register right accumulator is one type of register sequence counter is one type of register that will be reduced to one initially it will be n means in this scenario we are having 6 it will be reduced to 1 right then qn plus 1 is the next value 
next value means here this value in the multiplic and this value will be taken qn starting this will be 1 then it will change it to qn this one then qn plus 1 will be this one when qn is this one then qn plus 1 will be this one so like that it will be moved this side and it will be added like this very simple that scenario will be here when it is 1 0 it will be moved this side qn and qn plus 1 initially it will be 0 then it will be move on to these values when it is 0 0 it it simply shift arithmetic shift right and the sequence counter will be reduced to 1 right finally when sequence counter this is also a decision right diamond shape decision condition if condition when sequence counter is equal to 0 means all values are over in the multi multiplayer right all values here all values here are over 1 2 3 4 5 6 values are over then we are here and we are we got the final product that will be in the accumulator very simple right that will be in the accumulator final product accumulator register so that's it sequence counter if it is not equal to 0 and it will again move to this this place see the direct directions i keep directions also i'll show you you pause the video and draw the diagram in the google search engine also you can find the diagram draw the diagram two three times and which i am explaining now understand it clearly and write the bullet points if you only draw the diagram you will get half mark, half marks only for 10 marks you will get five marks only draw the diagram neatly and explain clearly every point write the full forms ac means accumulator a s h r means arithmetic sh means shift sh shift r means write arithmetic shift write accumulator qr register right qr is a variable qr register sc means sequence counter sc is reduced to one very simple those points you need to write in the explanation when it is not equal to zero it will move to here again qn and qn plus one will be shifted there and that will be compared here 0 1 and 1 0 if it is 0 1 simply it will be added accumulator will be added accumulator plus br register right very simple i will show you here accumulator plus br register will be added if it is 1 0 it will be that in the two's complement here br complement br bar br convert invert means br will be one's complement br value register and it will be added to one it will get two's complement and it will add it to accumulator because there will be no subtraction gate already told you in my previous videos right then it will be done this then sequence counter is reduced to one until when it is reached to zero it will be ended so happy end we will get the value accumulator that will be stored in the accumulator register that will be given in the last box this is a formula right for that this is a flow chart see here right pass the video and draw the diagram this is a hardware implementation this diagram and this is the matter and this is the example this is the example this is a hardware implementation and this is a flow chart diagram this is a key point tools complement for signed values right means uh, negative values or plus x into minus y or minus x into plus y or minus x into minus y this type of scenario situations we use both multiplication al algorithm andrew Do donald booth is a scientist name right write neatly and clearly use two black pens and two blue pens right neatly you may get any question i have shown you the question paper also at the end i will put the playlist and the multiplication algorithm previous video also in the see the diagram completely right very simple if you have any doubts you can feel free to call me i will give you my mobile number 9849 18 19 23
is my mobile number you can call me at any time if you have any doubts whatsapp me right i am working hard for you to get good percentage and improve your past percentage also and for your better and best career all the best my dear students